Good morning guys and welcome to Velvet Hammer Fitness. Well, I was so excited about my upcoming vacation this week that I forgot to record you an intro for our express full body summer shredder workout. So I'm doing that right now out in the beauty of my backyard here. Actually, this is my front yard. We have lots of beauty around here. So anyway, today's workout is going to be a lot of fun. It's going to start out with some true Tabata because we always want to stay true to that Tabata. So you're going to have eight rounds of squat jumps, eight rounds of push-ups. Then we're going to go into a nice little hit set. That's 10 exercises at a 45-15 tempo, and we're doing that twice. Then we'll cool it down, and you can get on with your day, okay? And I can get on with my vacation. <laughs> um, anyway, so I hope you have a lot of fun with this workout. All you'll need is your amazing body. Don't forget it's amazing. You could use a weighted vest if you want to. Um, and you need a lot of water and your can-do attitude, so strap it on, and I will see you back here for the warm-up. All right, guys, let's get your express full body summer shredder workout started with a good warm up. So important. All right, we're just gonna start this one by mining out some jump ropes. Now if you don't wanna jump, you could always do this here. You could do some high knees, okay? I'm gonna jump. Hey, you could do the running man if you want to. If you're just feeling the dancing room, Rock out the running man. Bring back some good or bad memories. Start taking it two-footed. About 10 more seconds here. Then we're gonna go into some box squats. Over to your box or your couch. Sit up and squeeze. It's a good way to get your squat range of motion started without having to get deep into those joints before you're ready. Just a couple more seconds here. Three, two, one. Awesome. We're going to the ground for some knee push-ups. Even if you can do toe push-ups, let's warm up the knees first, okay? So many mat treasures on my mat this morning. So many unidentified falling objects here. Remember, when you're doing these push-ups, get your weight toward the outside of your palm, towards your pinky. Protect those wrists. Couple more here. Three more. That's more than a couple. <laughs> Good job, lower that chest. Excellent. All right, I don't know what that is. Can move it, hopefully it's nothing yucky. All right, now we're gonna do some reverse lunges from here. We're recording really late today because I'm feeling like a rebel. I'll probably pay for it. <laughs> But, on a positive note, my coffee has had its chance to kick in, so I'm a little more awake, which might mean I'm a little more or less wacky, I don't know. Good reverse lunge here. Think about your hip flexor lengthening, stretching dynamically to help you get right down into the ranges of motion you need for this workout. One more each side. All right, since we don't just move in one plane of motion, we're gonna go side to side here. I have some nice raw hamstrings from a workout I did a couple days ago. I'm going to be going to the beach next week, so I'm trying to record as much as I can this week so that I can truly take a vacation. I have not taken a week off of Velvet Hammer Fitness since it started two years ago. So even though I've been on vacation, I've always recorded something <sighs> or edited something. So next week I'm going to try not to do that. 
do one more each side. All right, here we go with some high knees. Again, you can take these low impact, but you just have 13 seconds. So let's knock them out. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh yeah. All right. You are all finished with your warm up. If you want to get your weighted vest on for this, go right ahead. If not, get a slug of water, your can do attitude on, and I'll see you back here for our express body weight summer shredder workout. All right, guys, we are ready to start your workout. Your first move is squat jumps, and we are doing this true Tabata style. So eight rounds of squat jumps is your way to usher in this workout. Here we go. I am not wearing my vest today because I did a pretty brutal leg workout quad workout, quad and shoulder focused workout very recently, so <laughs> I'm not going to add insult to injury there. <sighs> Only seven more to go. Whee! Aren't you glad this workout is express? So in doing express workouts, at least the ones that I make up, I try to make them extra intense so that you don't miss the time. <laughs> Four, three, two, one. Whew! Straighten in that picture. You could also do squats here. Burning so badly, huh? Use those powerful glutes to get you up there. Two, one. Two, and one. I won't tell you how many we've done, but I'm guessing knowing you all, you already know. I think I'm the only one who can't keep track of Tabata intervals. <sighs> Breathe it out. There we go. What I want you to think about is not how many intervals are left, but just getting to the end of the interval you're on. It's the beauty of HIT. <sighs> Mentally digestible. <sighs> Two, one, getting close. If you want to do jumping jacks here, if you want to do scissor squats, whatever you can do to keep the intensity up to keep moving, to keep yourself going. Oh, oh yeah. Seven of eight here. Here we go. I didn't think I was super sore from my quad and shoulder workout until I started doing this. Four, three, two, one. Lead legs. We have one more to go. Here we go. True Tabata is truly a chore, but if you don't have much time, man, will it deliver. Big jumps. This is your last round. Last three seconds. Big ones. Very good. I guess I can get a drink. You have push-ups in that same format next. Go 
get your breath back. A couple tips with push-ups. You can do them on your knees. You can take your feet nice and wide. You can do all of that. Um, you can hold a plank if you get into trouble because this is eight rounds. So just know you have something that you can do. You don't just have to quit. Okay? You have five seconds. Push up. At least you get to get your breath back here, right? Very good. Stretch them out. You can do every other interval knee and then the next interval toe. Totally fine. You can do two and two. Two knees, two toes. Less than ten. Very good. Cactus arms if you need to. Push out that chest. Getting close. The end of that interval. Very good. We won't talk about how far we've come or how much we have to go. We're just going to keep doing it. All right, here we go again. Use that chest. Make sure you're not shrugging. Very good. Shoulders are smarting. Woo. Five of eight. Think about your chest, think about your shoulders and triceps, everything working equally. It's getting hard to do what you can. Hold a plank, do knee push-ups, whatever you need to do. Alright. Slow up your pace. Make them quality. Whew. I made a stop one second earlier there. But who's counting? You have two more sets of these. So if you need to start on your knees. Go ahead and knock out a few on your knees, okay, and come back or stay down as long as you're moving. Use these as drop sets if you need to. Sweating already. Good sign. Very good. You have one more. Plastic bead on my leg, because why not? <laughs> The stuff that I find in this room. You'd think I never vacuum, but I do it regularly. Almost there. Push up to Bada is no joke, but it's over. So. We are going into our, wow, that's not a full towel. We're going into our next section, which is hit. It's gonna be a 45, 15 tempo. So gear up for it. We're starting off with fast feet. All right, you 
you have 15 seconds. You can do any variation of fast feet you'd like. Here we go. Remember, muscle shakes too. So do not body shame yourself if your legs are shaking. My legs are shaking. My behind shaking. Everything's shaking, so don't worry about it. We do a little Tina Turner. It's no mystery how she got her crazy legs. You can do fast feet both ways. Shuffle, you can do in and out. Fast feet, whatever you have to do to keep your feet fast. Five seconds. Done. All right, tricep push up on the left. Okay, so you're gonna lay on your right actually. Hug yourself with your right arm, push up with your left, okay? I sure hope you can see me. Hey buddy, can you see me in the camera? Can you see me in the camera? Yeah, okay. I got my production assistants with me today. Because again, I slept in knowing that I needed some extra sleep. Extra sleep helps us reduce the amounts of cortisol in our body, which makes us think we're always in a dire situation, makes us store fat, and actually does not help us regulate our temperature very well. So get rid of that cortisol and go to sleep for a little while. Okay? All right, surfers are next. I'll show you a little modification you can do for these surfers if you'd like. Hoping I don't hit my arms on the wall. Now a little skater trick. Pull those arms in. Help you rotate. My coach would be so proud of me. This one's for you, Martha. Now, if you want to do a scissor step in the middle for your skaters, totally fine. If you're not feeling like a surfer today or a skater, You're tired. Very good. All right. Tricep push up on the right. So tired. So tired. Okay. Hug yourself with the left. Here we go. Really focus, pushing up with that tricep. You get nice and straight. One of my friends, cutie little boys, who comes with them to my boot camp class, said, "Miss Kinsey, you're not straight." <laughs> so. When I was doing these tricep push-ups, so I fixed it. Cause I did not want to disappoint him. All right, Ooh. all right. Oh, curtsy lunge jumps. So you can just do curtsy lunges here if you want. I'm hoping I have enough room here. All right. So you can skate, curtsy, skate, curtsy. Mine are not going to be huge. You can also just take your curtsy low impact. I'm gonna to try to jump up since I don't have a lot of lateral room. Always something you can do. This is gonna look a little wonky. So I'm not going 
for speed, I'm just kind of going for height and range of motion. Very good. Three pike burpees are next. I'm going to add a push up just because this is a short workout. So, here we go. So, pike three times, down into a burpee, and up. I like to dynamically go into that push up, but you can do it this way or leave the push up out completely. Almost there. So tired. This is a good one. Five seconds. Alright, we got rolling V-ups. These are gonna be hard because of my space, but that's okay. At least you get a lay down, right? So, V up this way, roll to the center, V up in the center, roll the other side, V up. Very good. Always make these knee tucks as well, where you just draw your knees in. Okay, very good. Oh, good times. All right, curtsy burpee on the left. So we're only curtsying towards the left, okay? I want you to stay nice and low. So curtsy, you can just stick to a half burpee. You can add whoops, a jump. You can add a push up. Whatever you want to do. If you want it to be more leg focused, stick low and stick with that half burpee. We're going to do this on the other leg, so no worries. Five seconds. So nice. Knee tucks. We're gonna do four reptiles, four obliques, four just straight, okay? One, here we go. One, two, three, four, oblique. Two, three, four, straight. Two, three, four, back out. Reptile. Two, three, four, oblique. One, two, three, four, straight. One, two, three, four, low. Two, repeat. Three, four, one, oblique. Two, three, Four, straight. One, two, three, four. Out again. Two, three, four. Oh, okay, we're doing a curtsy burpee only on the right. Okay. Whew. Good morning. Stay back there for a minute. Okay. Whew. Oh, I'm so tired, guys. Whew. Luckily, we only have one more round of this. Or you can keep it here and just curtsy, staying low, just like that. Okay, I'm again going to use my arms and jump. If this is a short workout, we want to make the best of it, the most of it. If you want full body. Oh yeah, party time. Ooh. Okay. 
Very good, guys. All right, you have one more round of this. Take a drink, take a quick break if you want, or go right ahead into your next set. All right, guys, are you ready for round two? I had to take a little break to make a little girl breakfast, so <laughs> um, a really quick breakfast. So here we go with our second round of fast feet. So I got a nice little break there. Probably about two minutes. All right. Oh, yeah. Four, three, two, one. Here we go. Fast feet. You can move them. That's kind of fun. You can turn them all around. Just have fun. You can take a forward and back. In and out. You have 20 seconds left. Have fun. Shake it, shake it, shake it. Got nice and low. Feel it in your calves. Embrace the shake. I'm shaking. You're shaking. One. Whew. All right. Try some push-ups on your left arm, but you're laying on your right side, which is so confusing. I know. <sighs> Party time. All right. Whew. Give yourself a hug around the neck. Take it up and down. Up. Down, up, down, up, down, up. How am I doing? Down, up, up. thanks. Up, down, up, down. Push, down, push, down. 18 seconds. Your next move is going to be a surfer. Don't forget your skater arms to help you rotate. Five seconds. Ooh, play around with your positioning there. If you don't feel it in your triceps, then you need to change the position of your hand. I end up doing that three or four times before I'm done. Okay, here we go. All right, you're gonna knock over that leg early. Okay, here we go. Always an interesting, filming session when the kiddos are up, but I think I'm better equipped patience wise to deal with it because I'll slip. Big jumps. See how I'm pulling my arms in to help me rotate? Side note, your kids do need to see you doing healthy things. Not just making them healthy meals, but taking time to make yourself a healthy meal. Taking time to exercise, be thankful for your body, not picking it apart. <sighs> you see somebody crawling in pajamas, that's my little girl. All right. <sighs> we are doing tricep push-ups, right arm, which means we're laying on the left side. I've fallen and I can't get up. <laughs> Here we go. Push, push, scoot down a little bit so I can be straight. This arm, very fatigued. Next is our curtsy lunge, hops or jumps. seconds. Six. Two. One. Some fun and classic hit moves are what make up this workout. All right. You could also, with these curtsy lunge jumps, instead of doing a curtsy lunge, you can do a lateral hop if you don't have much room, okay? You go for it and stay back there, please. Woo! So these are fun, but again, you can 
stick to your curtsy lunge. Usually, you're looking for more of a lateral jump here. I'm jumping high, or just because I don't have a lot of room. Eight seconds. Four, three, two, one. Oh my goodness. Okay. Breathe it out. Get a drink if you need it. Three bite burpees. All right. Here we go. One, two, three. Oh yeah. Do whatever kind of jump you want. You could basically do a pipe jump at the top. You could do a tuck. You want it to be more ab focus. Make it your own. Five seconds. Whew. Thank goodness that was done. Rolling B ups. Again, you could just do knee tucks here. All right, so you can just take them here, here, here. You could do one leg at a time. Try to do it with some control. Doing great. Six seconds. Woo! Rushing. All right. Very good. You have curtsy burpees on the left. Okay. Four, three, two, one. So nice little curtsy. Hip square. Very good. Okay. Knee tucks are next. Breathe it out. You can always do these knee tucks on your actual knees. Okay? And just stick to the reptile. All right, here we go. And a phone call, because why not? Three, four, oblique. Two, three, four, straight. One, two, Three, four, reptile. Two, three, and four. Oblique. Two, three, four, straight. Two, three, four, oblique. One, less than ten. Oh. I think I said oblique instead of reptile first. That's okay. You know what you're doing, luckily. Whew. All right, your last move is that curtsy burpee on the right. I am toasted, guys. Hope you are too. Here we go. The key here, stand low, landing low.
no room, no problem with these moves. You can do these in a hotel room, on the beach, in the mountains, as long as you have enough oxygen. Four seconds. Wow. All right, guys. You're all finished for today. Take a break, take a breather. Let's cool down and get you out and on with your day. Awesome job. All right, guys, let's get to that cool down. We're gonna start with just a nice, slow, low lunges. Get your heart rate down. Hold it on the right. Getting those hip flexors nice and stretched out. Now we're gonna send the hip up. Straighten the front leg as much as you can. Step the back foot up to the front. Get a little hamstring stretch here. Send the right foot back. Little lunge here. Really get into those hip flexors. Awesome. Send the heel back. Send the front leg a little straighter. Awesome. Send that back foot up front. One more little hamstring stretch here. You can either hop or step back into plank. We're going to lower down into a cobra. Try to keep those shoulders away from the ears. Lower down, back into plank. We're going to hit a little lizard stretch. We're going to take our one leg wide. And I want you to open up your chest as well. Take it back, back into plank, other side. Excellent. Back into plank, back into tabletop position. Get those knees out wide here. Go into child's pose. Go to the right. Shift our weight back into our hips, into our heels. So when we come back up, let's hit those arms. Okay, step stretch, same side. Other arm. Stretch. Take those fingers, interlace them in the front, roll your shoulders over. And take them up. All right, let's crisscross the arms back and forth. Make sure we're nice and loose. Then let's do a couple of inhales and exhales. Inhale up, exhale down. Inhale up, exhale down. Inhale up, 
Exhale down. Inhale up one more time. Exhale down. Oh, guys, you are all finished. Get out, get going with your busy day and your fun summer plans, and I'll see you back up at the camera. Awesome work. All right, guys, awesome job crushing your express full body summer shredder workout. That's almost as hard to say as it is to do. Anyway, get a lot of water in your body today, especially during these hot summer days. I would have loved to film outside today, but it was very wet. We've had either really scorching days or really wet days this summer, so it's been really hard to film out there. But maybe we'll get one in before it's all said and done. What I also need you to do today is get a healthy post-workout meal on your plate 30 to 90 minutes after this workout, no matter how busy you are. If you have questions about what to eat or how to put it together, um, if you have personal training or nutrition questions in general, online coaching, please email us at velvethammerfitness at gmail.com. Also hit us up there if you would like to sign up for our four-week glute growing program. We promise it will not disappoint, okay? So stretch some more if you need to today, foam roll. Please tell all of your friends and family about us. We would love to share the beautiful gift of health and loving your own body with them, okay? So you like and subscribe, have them like and subscribe, and have a really fun time getting healthy with us this summer, okay? Remember to get enough sleep because of... One, you'll be in a lot better mood and you'll want to do your workouts more, but also because getting enough sleep helps us reduce the cortisol levels in our body, okay? Cortisol can just cause your body to think it's in panic mode all the time and store a little fat, especially around the middle, um, and it can also really inhibit your ability to regulate your temperature on really hot days, okay? So, get rid of the cortisol, sleep as much as you can, make that your next right choice this week, okay? Also, love all those difficult people in your life, You'll probably be on a plane with them, on a vacation, in a restaurant with them, or maybe at the park with them. I'll have to tell you all that story some other time. I had a difficult person that I did not do very good about loving last week. So anyway, do better than I did this week. Crush your kindness goals. And whether you felt like you were super shredded after this workout in a very small amount of time or whether you felt like it just shredded you to pieces <laughs> and left you limping away it is your health today and every day and you finished it so you better hit it hard boom have an awesome week guys i'm so proud of you happy summer if it's summer where you are and i will see you soon